Fresh and Famous, where we spend fresh music interview famous artists. Our surprising guest for tonight was on season nine of American Idol. She has an uh, EP out now called Handmade Songs by Tori Kelly on iTunes. Won an awards for the most amazing voice in Fresh and Famous history. Tori Kelly, what's the deal? Hey, what's up? Did you like that intro? <laughs> Dope, dope, dope. So, how's everything been? I mean, how's your, how's your, uh, how's June going so far for you? June has been really exciting. Um, I've been keeping busy. Aside from writing music all the time, I'm uh, actually been a part of a new project. It's a new TV show coming out that I can't really say much about. Mm. But that kind of took up um, a lot of my time last month. Um, but yeah, it airs. It's a new show that airs in September, so that's I'm really excited for that. So people find out what that's going to be. Nice, nice, nice. Is it going to be like dramatic, or is it going to be a, a, a musical, or can you just give us that like this? I think I can say as much as um, it's going to be a new game show, um, oh. and I'm I'm more on the side of it. So, um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I can say about it. But I'm really excited. <laughs> Probably after, you know, after, like, when we go off air, you can just, like, you know, sneak the title to me a little bit, you know? <laughs> maybe, maybe. Definitely. We'll be hearing promos for it soon, so. Definitely. We'll, be, soon, we'll be ready for it. We'll be ready for it. Now, when exactly did you start doing music? I should say I've been doing music um, probably for as long as I can remember. I don't remember, like, a exact date or age when I really started to get into it. Um, I kind of just grew up around music all the time. Growing up, um, really musical family. My dad uh, sings and he plays bass. And um, and my mom grew up playing piano. So there's always uh, always something musical going on. And um, I would say that I got, I got really serious about actually like producing um, my own music mm-hmm. uh, when I was about 15. I started, um, I started just putting all my ideas on GarageBand because I didn't have, like, anything else to really, like, let go and just release all my creativity. So, um, yeah, I was really blessed with my parents got me uh, Logic a year later, mm-hmm. Logic Pro 8. So now I got a little studio set up. So, yeah, it's been fun. Nice, making <laughs> magic. really blessed. Making magic, I see that. So I know you've been discovered by a lot of people, and I know you are mostly known from the Freak, Co- Freak Ocean cover. When did you realize your popularity level started going up? Oh gosh, that cover was crazy. Um, yeah, my friend, my friend Andy and I, we just kind of uh, we had done videos in the past, mm-hmm. um, and we just decided to kind of get together and do another one just for fun, and we had no idea that it was going to blow up like that. Nice. Um, and I think within within the week or, or a couple weeks, it made. I don't know actually within a few days, I think it made um, world star hip hop. And I'm embarrassed to say that at the time, I had no idea what it was. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but it like opened my eyes to a whole new world. And I was like, what is this? Oh my goodness! And after that, it just it just kept going up, and then it hit a million. And um, once it hit a million, it went even faster. And now I think it's almost at like four million views. So. And you know, yeah. and you know, it's, it's crazy because like, that's what people like some of the people know you by that, like some of the people actually heard that heard heard you do the cover before they even heard the actual Frank Ocean song. I mean, Jazzy right. probably did. I've, I've heard, <laughs> I heard your song before I heard Frank Ocean's. Like, I was a big wow, fan. I showed Jay. Insane. I was like, look at this girl. Like, she's amazing. Like, watch her. Like, how did, when did you start playing the guitar? Um, I started uh, probably around the same time I started doing music, like off and on since I was 15. And at first, I didn't even have my own guitar. I was borrowing a friend. Mm-hmm. And um, I, I felt like I just needed something to help with um, the writing process because I didn't really have, I mean, I had a piano, but for some reason, it didn't, it didn't click as well as uh, the connection I had with the guitar. For some reason, I just felt like it fit my style more. Yeah. So, um, yeah, so I finally, got, my parents got me my own guitar uh, <laughs> when I was about 16. So, yeah, a few, a few years. That's awesome. 
That's dope. That's dope. Yeah, you got to te- you got to teach me a few things, Tori, because I'm I'm just learning how to play the electric guitar. So I'm just doing like a few covers. I was trying to get on your level at first, but I couldn't. I can't play the guitar while singing. So yeah, I might have to have a Torius tutor. <laughs> Nice. The, here's here's another question that we have. You have an EP out ca- called uh, "Handmade Songs" by Tori Kelly. Just explain right. to us the whole concept of the EP. The concept, basically, uh, I wanted to call it "Handmade Songs" by Tori Kelly because they're literally handmade songs by me. Mm-hmm. Um, this kind of this kind of thing that I, uh, you know, did everything myself from start to finish, and um, every everything like mixing and stuff, other than mastering. Actually, I had a Good friend of mine, Jesse Guerrero, shout out. Uh, do the mastering on it, but um, yeah, everything else is done by me. My my dad is um, playing bass on a few tracks, but um, I mean, there's really no there's no like full concept, I would say, or a theme to the album. Um, mm-hmm. I kind of just wanted to throw it out there. I felt like it was um, a good time to kind of just you know have something to sell at shows and. Mm-hmm. Um, I really had no music out other than like a few singles, so I wanted to kind of just throw it out there. Really, it wasn't anything like official. There's no label involved, you know. It's just kind of like a little project that I wanted to do, and it ended up doing really well. I was really surprised with um, the success of it so far. So it's really exciting. That's so dope. That's, That's so awesome. dope. Jazzy, what's this next question right here? <laughs> okay, so if you could have any artist, any artist to collab with in the studio, who would it be? So hard. I guess it's a lot. I can never choose one. <laughs> um, I think it would be down to, I would love to collab with uh, John Mayer. I think oh, he's amazing. Oh. Um, I think that would be the one that would be really fun. <laughs> Uh, and also Lenny Kravitz for some mm-hmm. reason. I always thought he was so cool. Tori has a good taste <laughs> of music. Coming down to those three, though. <laughs> That's yeah, awesome. have a good taste of music. That's dope. So what is what is TK? I, I call you TK, by the way. What is TK like to do besides music? I mean, I know you have a family who, you know, everybody's doing music constantly. Yeah. But besides music, what do you like to do? Besides music, well, now that it's summertime, um, we live on a lake and we got a boat. So we like uh, going out there and wakeboarding and uh, just chilling on the lake, doing summery stuff. <laughs> um, yeah, but I mean, other than other than that, music definitely takes up all my time. I mean, um, my brother plays soccer, mm-hmm. so that's another fun thing. I like on being a supportive sister and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. That's good. So yeah, pretty much. That's pretty much what I do. That's good. That's good. We got we got I'm, Tori. I'm really boring. <laughs> no, you're not. Not at no, all. <laughs> yeah. You got you got to taste the music. That's all that matters right now. <laughs> okay, so we have Tori Kelly on the line right here with uh, J.O. and Jazzy on freshandfamous.com. Now, our last question for today, uh, Tori, is that do you have, because you were on American Idol Season 9, do you have any yeah. words of encouragement to the people who are thinking about trying out for American Idol? I would say to anyone who about trying out um, to definitely definitely be yourself but find find that something in you that's unique that you think will set you apart because they're definitely looking for something that'll stand out mm. and a big thing for me that I realized that if you don't end up making the show um, just don't let it get to you at all it it's definitely comes down to it being a TV show and they're always looking for a cast at the end of the day mm-hmm. so um Definitely. And, yeah, and, and, you know, the crazy thing is it seems like the people who, you know, who get voted out are the ones that end up, like, more popular, you know, in the future. Like, yeah. Jennifer Hudson, you, you know, like, that's that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, it was definitely a fun experience. I, wouldn't, I don't regret anything about it. So I met so many of my great friends through that show, too. So. Do you hate Sam and Kyle? <laughs> no, no, never. Okay. Never. It, was, it was a TV <laughs> show. He's really cool. He's a cool awesome. guy. Okay. No, no hard feelings towards him. <laughs> 
Definitely, definitely. You already heard it from Tori Keller, her, Tori Kelly herself. Dudes love Tori Kelly. Make sure you listen to her EP titled "Handmade Songs" by Tori Kelly on iTunes, and you can find it on her Twitter at Tori Kelly. That's T O R I K E L L Y. Tori, I want to thank you so much. Or T K. I want to thank you so much for being on tonight's radio show. Uh, before we go, I mean. Is there any kind of like, I don't know, just any kind of snippet that you can give us that's on your EP? Like just, you know, sing it a cappella. Can you do that for us before we get off? I mean, we see the YouTube videos. We see, we see the YouTube videos and everything. So we're just like, maybe or maybe not. Maybe not. We can, you know, maybe we can get uh, some, a little something out of her. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'll sing all of this. Okay. I told you, Jackie. I told you. <laughs> Gotta keep myself in check sometimes. Cause I tend to think real quick sometimes. The fancy office never thought to be a war. I ain't the right for people I just have to do it. But I gotta remember to take it one step at a time. People see the thing. So be happy once you reach time. Jazzy, were you trying to sing along I, with it? No, uh, well, I can't sing, but um, <laughs> I'm sweating. <laughs> That's awesome, Tori. That's so pretty. You have That's a beautiful dope. voice. Oh my God, Tori Thank Kelly on the so beautiful voice. Tori Kelly on the line right oh. now. Definitely get her EP if if you. That's the reason to get her EP right now. Check it out on iTunes. All right, yo, what's up, guys? It's me, Tori Kelly, and I'm on Fresh the Famous Radio. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me. No guys. problem, you guys. You have a good one, okay? 